How's Tony, man? Uh, is he feeling any better? Have the doctor said anything? The doctors told you, Thea, that he would be fine with surgery. He needs to remove his appendix, but if he doesn't get it removed soon, they said they're not certain. I don't know what to do, Miha. We don't have any money and we can't risk being caught out here. We can't go back. How much time do we have? A week. I'll get the money, okay? I will. I'll, I'll, I'll find a way to get it. I promise. I love you, Miha. Take care of yourself. Eat something, please. I know how you are when you get stressed. Make sure you do your laundry too, bit of so sad. May God watch over you, Miha. Mama, I love you too. Night. Hey, so I know there's not much I can do to help you feel better, but keep you company and we do have drinks. I appreciate that, Joey. Of course. So you won't talk about it? I mean, we don't have to if you don't want to, but I understand. It's just not looking good for Tony. You know, it's like every day there's more bad news. Like, it was hard enough to come here with my mom, you know, to pursue that education, that American dream. You know, going to college was like a miracle. And then this happens and it's like we can't, we can never get a break. I keep having this like, this dream. Well, it's not a dream, it's more like a nightmare. But it starts off as a dream. Like I'm in, in the boardwalk in Santa Cruz and my mom used to take me and Tony there sometimes. And like it's, as a child, like I knew that we didn't have a lot of money. You know, like the money was tight and we couldn't just you know, go. But my mom, she would always try to convince me. She was like, come on Mika, let's go get a churro from over there. But by the time we got there, we, We'd waste all our money just getting there. And we didn't have money for food or ride. But in, in the nightmare, um, I'm in the ocean and I'm looking at my mom and Tony. You know, they're, they're in the sand and they're playing and they look happy. And then this wave or a current comes and it takes me under. And then I'm looking up and I could see that, you know, like that thin line between air and, and water, you know, between life and well, death. And a current comes and just takes me down. You know, I'm, I'm drowning. And then I feel the water start to rush into my lungs and I can't breathe. And then just as I'm about to pass out, I can't wait that. It's awful, Danny. I'm sorry. Every night? Every night. Well, hey, I'm here for you. Always. And I know you just wanted me to listen, but what are you going to do? I mean, it's Tony. I don't know what to do. Like, there's no options, you know? The, like, this whole situation is just... well, fucked. Fuck! 
You know what I think about all the time? What it must be like to be rich, you know? Imagine not having to worry where your next meal is coming from. It's like they have no problems, you know? Remember that fucking frat that got off the hook last year for hazing? Well, I'm throwing this huge party this weekend. Really? Wasn't it like in the news? Yeah, and they didn't do anything? Nothing. Not a damn thing, not a slap on the wrist or anything, and guess what? What? President Dickhead is asking for all members to pitch in cash only. He says he doesn't want any broke bitches partying in his palace. Jesus. I know, and get this. You remember Andres? He used to live across the street from me. Yeah. Well, he told me it's not just member donations. They have a whole side deal going where they're raking in thousands in cash. You don't need thousands for a party. Guns, drugs, money, doesn't matter what it is, but nothing ever happens to them. I promised my mom that someday we wouldn't have to worry about anything. You know, that, that it would be okay. And every time I told her that, she would tell me that she trusted me, that I knew what I was doing. But this time she, she didn't say anything. I don't have time for someday anymore. If she lost hope, then I don't know what to do. How much is it? Which is what? The what money, the about? fucking money, how much is it? 50,000. At least, that's what I've heard. Has anyone tried to get it before? No. <laughs> Nobody would dare, they'd be buried. You wanna know something? What? This is the first time for everything. Danny, what the fuck are you talking about? You wanna rob a frat? You're joking, right? Please tell me you're fucking with me. Why would I be joking? I mean, what other options do I have, huh? I can't take out loans without putting myself in a bigger hole. And my mom, my mom can't pay for the surgery because she's already in debt. You wanna know something, Jesus? Money doesn't just conveniently fall out of the sky. You can't be serious. You're not thinking straight. Take a moment and think about this, please. Well, I don't have time to think. Do you hear yourself right now? What the hell is wrong with you? You can't rob a frat? Danny, your life isn't a fucking There's movie. nothing else! There is nothing that can get me what I need right now. Okay, right now, what I know is that there's $50,000 sitting in that frat house. Right now, what I know is that my brother's going to die and nobody is doing a goddamn thing about it. Not you, not my mom, not the doctors, not the government. Right now, what I know is that my brother's dying. Nobody gives a fuck. You seriously think that I don't know that I can't do this? I'd be risking everything if I get caught. I'd get jail time, they'd send my mom back. I'd lose my education, scholarships. All right, but all of that is worth the risk if that means that my little brother gets to live. So are you gonna do something or are you just gonna keep telling me what I can or can't do? Is that, or? I'm not 100% sure, but I mean, it's gotta be in the president's room, right? So that's all you got, huh? And why the fuck are you eating right now? Hey, Dude! I wasn't planning on robbing a fraternity tonight, okay? So cut me some slack. Besides, they're arrogant. They probably just leave it around lying somewhere. Okay? Okay, and. What about the people in the house, huh? The frat members. Danny, it's a frat house. 
All they do is get drunk, get high, and play beer pong. Just gotta wait it out, okay? So that's your amazing plan, huh? We're gonna wait for them to smoke, then we're gonna go inside, get the money, come out. That simple, huh? Do you want it to be harder? I can make it harder, okay? Easy money, I'm telling you. Just gotta wait, okay? Because you had to leave the fucking party. That's why it's your problem. Do that shit one more time. Do what? This? Huh? What are you gonna do? I'm gonna get you kicked out of this school if I wanted to, man. And I can kick your ass. You know what? Get the fuck out of here. I'm tired of looking at your stupid face. You can steal from me? That's my fucking money! Hey! Get off of me, broke ass loser! Fuck! Fuck! This was supposed to happen. This was supposed to happen, Danny. Fuck! Hey! Wake up! Can you take the money back? Just please wake up. That's what happened. Fuck! Danny, I need you to listen to me. You need to go. You need to go right I now. I can't just Danny, go. I'm not gonna please, go. No. Please, no. I need you to go. I'm not asking. They're gonna come please, and they're gonna please. find you here with me. I'm not gonna go. No. no.
You 